Hello and welcome back to Don't Star Reign of Giants. This is the fourth episode, let's continue our world. Frankly, I don't think this world is salvageable, but we'll try our best. We'll try our best to salvage that. The interesting thing about this game is that when you die, you can just start over, you get bonuses, and you keep going. You keep going until you find the optimal setup, the optimal, you know, things, farms and stuff. But you really gotta try hard to just live on. As you can see, we have no food, so like no means of survival. Ten food left, it's not good, it's not hot. We don't have like anything. I had a grass suit somewhere here. Yes, it's here. We are drilling during the night, so... And in rain. So that sucks. We have to wait off the night and then... Go scavenge for some food. If we don't get some food really, really fast, we're gonna be screwed. Like, absolutely destroyed. I'm thinking about returning like there. There could be some food. I have five food left. I'm probably gonna die. As you can pro as you can tell. I'm not gonna live long. By the end of this night I'm probably gonna take some damage. Start taking hunger damage. Which is going to kill me. I should just make a run for the reviving altar. And I'm taking damage. Very fast. I'll make a run for it. It's somewhere there. I have no idea where exactly. But I'll try to get as close to it as, it as it's possible. It's here. So, is there any food nearby? Hmm. I'm not gonna break that. There doesn't seem to be any food, like, anywhere. <laughs> can get some seeds and eat. The situation is really not, not too hot. It's bad. It's very, very bad. We just have to eat whatever we find. I really chose a bad place to settle, you know. There's like nothing nearby. Nothing. I'd like this biome to end so I can find some bushes. We'll go down. Wet walrus camp. That's not something we can eat. stuff that made winter no this world is not not salvageable a breezy vest an axe logs cut grass twigs and an ice stuff I'm sorry brother but I gotta kill you and I died. Uh, this is not viable. This is definitely not viable. I'm gonna die again. Let me go and retrieve my stuff before I freeze to death. 
This game is hard, man. This game is hard. It is really, really hard. I'm already freezing. And my things are all the way there. I think I'm gonna die. I won't even make it there. Yep, I'm screwed. I'm completely toast. Goodbye, cruel world. It was not nice exploring you. This world sucked. It really, really did. But you know what? Let's not be sad. At least we tried. There are some carrots here. But I don't need carrots right now. I need my force. And I'm dead. GG! <coughs> we, we leveled up, we unlocked a new character! What character did we unlock? Let me see. Let's go to the main menu. And see what it's all about. Fire starter, immune to fire damage. Has a sweet lighter. Lights fires when nervous. Ah, willow. Should we? Mm, I don't think we should. Let's just go with Wilson. Let's start. Let's try again. Generating world, generating Wilson's bird, inserting a keen sense of despair, recalculating food, reticulating food, or what? New world, new day, new chances. We gotta be fast. We gotta focus. Get some resources going. Hello, Maxwell. Goodbye, Maxwell. We don't need your intro. Come on. Stone biome already, that is very very good. Very promising. We got a flint. We can start making f wood. Let's do it. Chop a chop a chop. Die your little tree. We should find some birches, because birches give their cones and their and birch cones are food. And food, as you probably guessed it, is very important in the game about not starving. Okay. I think I won't worry so fast about my crock pot. Even though it's an awesome thing to have. Because I just can't use it if I don't have enough food. It costs a lot of it. I should worry about getting seeds. Okay, two flints, that's enough to make a pickaxe. Let's make one! A pickaxe is a great thing. Get berries. Get twigs and get grass. It's okay. So we can ensure yourself some survival. I might just make an, a science machine, like somewhere, to get a backpack going and then keep on exploring until I find a proper place. I think that might be a good, that might be a good idea. Because a backpack is a huge thing. Early on. Okay, let's go. Let's go get some stone, some gold. Get started really well. <coughs> I 
Good to ensure we have some s resources right off the start. There is a swamp there, isn't there? You know, if we find a <coughs> if we find a pool, might be able to just survive off of that. Because you know, even though the game in the game. It's very important to get a nice location for your encampment. You have to remember that most of the things you can farm, you can just replace. So that's not that big of a concern, really. Let's see, is there a pool here? No, that doesn't seem to be one. That's a weird swamp, I've never seen a biome like that. It is quite obvious that the multiplayer version of the game. Oh, hello, Gloomer. Can I even mine Gloomer? I think I shouldn't. I think I should wait for the night. But there are birches here, and that is huge. Also, I like this biome. Not as much as, I as my friend I mentioned earlier, but it's good, but it's, it's nice. It's not that bad. At least not as bad as it gets. Although th there's not many resources here, I don't think. But those guys, birch nuts, you can cook those and use them as food, which is very, very nice. getting late, but we have a lot of resources, I gotta admit. I'm nice st starting to question the value of Yuker Bottom. She is like a walking science machine. At first I thought you could like, you know, uh, craft things one tier up, but no, she is just like a science machine. You cannot like st stand by a science machine and do things that are only allowed in the alchemy engine. It's not how it works. Let us see, let us see. See, I can't carry anymore. There are some bushes around, like here, a lot of them. So you could farm those. There are gravestones here. There is Gloomer. I think we'll settle here. Like forever. But let's find a place where there are no raccoons. Because these guys are bastards. They will make your life bad. Let's see, let's see. Uh, that's a nice open field. Don't seem to be any bad guys near. I wonder. Will I need anything else? Will I need anything else? That's gold. That's nice. You know what? That settles it. Uh, I'll come here. I'll make an my encampment right here. Remember, it's just an encampment. It doesn't make you stay here forever. A fire pit. A science machine. And right, right off the bat, I can make, my, make myself a backpack. Which is very, very nice. Now, let's think about it. Uh, I should get some tweaks going. Definitely. <coughs> and I need to find B flow. So I probably should explore right here. No, that's uh, an earth biome. I mean stone. I'll keep on going like there. Let's see. We'll see where it leads us.
I'll cook the beer nuts. And eat them! Because they're nice. I'll he hold on to these berries because you can make jam with them and that boosts your sanity. And sanity is, is a really crucial thing to have. Hi. Good light keeps you your sanity higher. Also things like hats, like this thing. Uh, here. So we get... Fix up the gradated clothing items. I didn't think that I see that anywhere else. A garland. Yeah, that fi that boosts your sanity. Helps you stay mentally stable. Mm, I'll cook the carrots. They'll hold on for longer. And berries too, why not? You know the night is for cooking, but who cares? Let's get an axe, chop down some trees. Know what? Uh, what does the crock pot cost? Three of those, six of those, and six of those. You know what? Mm, I should get some tweaks. And just make a shovel myself. Make myself a shovel. And start bringing some plants to my house. My encampment. <coughs> Having a few plants at your place is really necessary if you want to survive long enough. To have fun. Especially with the giants. Once once those guys start coming, it's not nice. These guys guys are just such bullshit. You don't even know. Or you probably do because you played this game. You know, sometimes I'm just full of shit. This guy could come in handy. If I could scare him into a corner. Which I sh for sure should be able to do. Because that's the end of the land. Quite nearby. Come on, guy. Go up. Come on, mister. He's too fast, I don't care enough. I shouldn't waste the day. It seems to be quite early in the cycle of night and day. I'll go down. Hope to find some things. Get some resources going. That's an interesting place. I'll take the axe. I'll take the crank thing. And I leave the evil flowers because they're really shitty for my sanity. They are the worst things. I could use this gold up there for the electrical doodads to make myself the alchemy engine. Okay, where should we go? Where should we go? We should go down there. Munch on some carrots. Feel my belly! What is that even? I'd love to find Chester. Chester is a great thing you have to have, you know. He's a portable 9 slot. Practically 8 because you have to hold his wand. That sounds dirty. That's a pigman, I thought it was a gravestone. For a moment. Blue mushroom. I don't know which one mushroom boosted, boosted your sanity, but one of the mushrooms was like really awesome for the sanity. 
It was either blue or green. I think it was green. I need a shovel to dig up those gravestones. But I'll get the gold. I gladly do. A wormhole here. Do you have things for a campfire? Yes, we do. This place is spooky, man. It really is those mists. Drive me nuts. They make me worried about myself. Worried about my health. Mostly mental health. Hello, gold. You only have one nighter. But we don't have to really worry about the nighter for now. At least. Is that a pool? Yes, it is. No, it. No, it's not. What is that? Seems to be like a hole. Just a hole in the ground. Hello, mister. Mind going above? I want your meat. I want it very bad. Thank you. That's useful. The morsel. I could use a crockpot to get it. Get it really, really useful. You know the, that I think about it. I'll make a li light. And I'll get some burning trees going. To get some charcoal. something I really wanna do. Yeah, where is my axe? Where is my axe? Is it, it broke, I think. What? I should make a campfire. Because those things burn up click quickly. Full on fire mode. There is my axe. Good thing I didn't make more axes. That would be such a waste to have free access if I'm in I myself. Where is the other tree? There it is. Only one charcoal from that one. That's not good. Not good at all. Would that carry over? How do you think? I should cook some things. Cook, cook, cook. Cooking like a pro. And eating like a madman. Let's proceed. Let's find some things. Preferably some buffalo. I will light this on fire, and that too. You know what, I don't care enough about this twig. So let it burn. Oh, come on, burn up, mister. Burn up, mister tree! I need your coal. Okay, I should have enough now. Ash is always useful for the healing glands. Salves, I mean. You need glands to heal. I 
think it's called healing salve. Cook the morsel that will preserve it for a little bit longer. Let's see, let's see. We're, we're back at the start. I'll follow the road. There's a savanna that is really nice. And there's gone. It's gone. The savanna is over. The spiders. I'll fight a few spiders. Get some monster meat for the crockpot. It's nice that you can stun lock those guys, and they drop a lot of food. If you have the crockpot, this food is really, really useful. It's really efficient. There are some rabbits here, I could, like, trap them. I'll get some grass going. In case it starts raining, I could make a hut for myself. Not that I think about it, I could make a hut for myself, even though it's not raining. But I think that would be a waste of grass, right now. At least for a while, I, I won't use a hut. It's killed. It's easy to kill. It's a good way. To get rid of those bastards. Where is the hole? Just stand by the hole and attack them. And they come in your hand. Don't think anything dirty, you be you bastards. I know what you fought there. But no, that's what that's not what I meant. You dirty minds. Dirty people. Where are my buffaloes at? Oh no, these guys. Mm -hmm. This is not a good biome. I don't like it. I'll just get the meat. I'll take in this, those berries. And run away! There's a pool here I could use. Should I kill this guy? I think I should get rid of him if I want to be happy. Fights with these guys are always very exciting. That was easier than I thought it would be. Let's eat the morsel. Get the fish for sure. The fish is great. I could leave like... Uh, what could I leave? I can stack those. No problem. Nothing said. The situation is looking very nice. I gotta admit, although I don't have any buffalo yet. Would be nice to get one. Or a few. Or a lot. For that, you know what? I think I might abandon that encampment right there. It only has a science machine, and then and this thing, which I can both afford, and it is not in a nice place there. The place here is much, much more you know, manageable. You shouldn't get atta attached to a place just because it looks nice. Because it was not a good place. I think I might wanna cross the swamp. Maybe not at night. <coughs> For the night I'll stay. 
try to get some food. No, the crock pot yet. Add some food, definitely. The guardland might come in, might come in handy. Here, I'm pretty now. Is the night getting shorter? That's odd. I really have to get my base going if I want to use those roast berries. You know what? I just eat them. I'll just start eating them. It's not really viable. Fast. It's okay. We're okay. We won't have problems. We shouldn't at least. Let's cook the frog legs. Now that I think about it... Mm, maybe I should hold on to these things. While I'm eating the berries. Will this fireplace be enough? Hmm. I should get a spear soon. A beeflow hat would be useful because you can attract beeflows, I think. Do you know what? That's it for this episode. Thank you very much for watching, for putting up with me, because I'm a bad at, I'm very bad at this game. And see you in the next one.